Uh, okay, I guess I'm gonna have to go to Phantom's house in a little bit. I don't even know where Coffee is and what's taking him so long. He's been on that phone call for a long time. I think I'm just gonna go. Oh, wait, Kitty, where are you going? Why are you leaving so early, Kitty? Is something wrong? Oh, um, nothing's wrong. Um, I just have to go home. Um, actually, my friend called me and he needs me. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna have to head out. I'm sorry I didn't need to leave in a rush, but yeah, I hope you can understand. Oh, um, well, since you're leaving early, I was just going to ask maybe if you wanted to go see the movies together tomorrow. Oh, um, to movies? Um, I don't know. I mean, I kind of have, I don't know. I don't really like going to the movies because of a certain situation. Um, how about I just let you know? Uh, maybe I'll call you tonight. I don't know. Or maybe send you a text message. I just really need to go. Oh, uh, that's, that's fine. Um, just give me a call and then we can definitely talk about it. Have a good night, kitty. Uh, yeah, bye. Bye. Uh, that was a close one. Hmm. I hope she calls. Uh, I hope Phantom answers. Phantom! Uh, who the heck? Um, girl, what are you doing here? Phantom, I need to tell you something. Let me in. Uh, okay, uh, girl, what are you doing out so late anyways? And why are you in your fox form? You know people aren't supposed to see you like this. Oh my god, Phantom, there's a lot to tell you. Can we just, like, go upstairs so I can talk to you about it, please? Uh, yeah, sure, you're more than welcome to. Alright, let's go. 20 minutes later. Girl, you told him all that information, and on top of that, he could be talking to Leo? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure, Phantom. I don't know. I thought I saw Leo, but I think I'm going to have to, like, dig through his phone next time. Is that kind of weird? I mean, if you can, go for it. You are the hacker of all hackers. Yeah, you're right. I'm going to have to think about doing that. But, yeah, I don't know. It's just been a really long night, and I don't know. It's just a lot going on. Girl, I think maybe you should just go to home and go to sleep or something like that. You know, try to relax a little bit. Also, I don't see coffee talking to Leo or anything like that. He doesn't seem like the type of guy to do that anyway. So, I don't know, Bestie. I think you're overthinking it. I think you just need some rest. <sighs> you're right. I think I'm just going to go home and relax. It's been a long day. But thank you for talking to me, Phantom. You're a really good best friend. Aw, you're welcome. Just try to get some rest, okay? And, you know, message me if anything. Okay, bestie, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Enjoy. And next time, bring food. Ah! Oh my god, Phantom. Kitty hasn't called and it's getting late. I wonder if she's okay. Wait, am, am I falling for her? No, 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 no. There's no way. I, I think I'm overthinking this. I'm just going to go brush my teeth and I'm going to get some sleep. I don't know. I don't know if I want to go to the movies tomorrow. I think I'm going to sleep on it. I should really call Coffee and let him know if I'm going to go or not. Because my ex works there. Actually, he owns a building. <sighs> okay. I'm going to call Coffee and let him know I think I'm going to go. Because last I saw, my ex was in jail. So he shouldn't be there. So I am think I'm going to call Coffee and tell him yes. I think I'm going to tell him yes. I think. I don't know. Okay, let me call him. Okay, better late than never, right? <laughs> Hello, coffee? Uh, what? Wait, what? Who's who's calling me this late? Oh, it's Kitty. Hey, Kitty. Oh, <clears throat> I mean, hey, Kitty. How's it going? Oh, hey, coffee. I'm sorry it's kind of late. Um, I just wanted to say, yeah, I think I will go to the movies with you tomorrow. Uh, what time do you want to go? Oh, yeah. Well, uh, I, I, I can pick you up at 8 tomorrow. Does that work? Yeah, actually, 8 works perfectly. I'll see you at my house then. Um, see you tomorrow at 8. Bye. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. Kind of sounds like we're on a date, but we're friends, right? Right? Okay, today's the day. Hope she's ready. I'm excited. I'm gonna ring the doorbell now. Kitty, it's me. Oh my god, he's here. Okay, I'm ready to go. Let's go on this movie date. I mean, movie friend date. Yeah, that's what it is. I'm excited. Hey, coffee. I'm ready for the movies. I'm so excited. Hey, kitty. Yeah, let's head on over so we can get our tickets. I'm excited. 
You look very nice, by the way. Oh, um, thanks, Coffee. That's really sweet of you. I really appreciate that. I mean, it's nothing special, but yeah, let's go. Let's go get our movie tickets and have fun. I'm excited. All right, Kitty, would you like some popcorn? Ooh, yes, I'd love some popcorn. And some candy, right? Yes, how did you know? Oh, I just had a feeling. Hey, sir, movie guy, could you get us some popcorn and some candy, please? Two popcorns and two candies coming right. What in the heck? Kitty, what are you doing here? Oh my gosh, this can't be happening. Tony? Tony? Yeah, Tony, that's me. What are you guys doing here? Are you like on a little date or something? No, no. we're just friends. Oh yeah, right, because friends just go on a movie date together at 8 o'clock at night at the movies. Gotcha. Whatever. Here's your two popcorn and candies. Uh, this is really awkward, okay? Thanks for the popcorn and the candies. Okay, bye. Yeah, thanks. Who does she think she is going on a date with a guy? I don't care what she says. That looks like a date to me. Let me do some investigating because she can't date anybody else but me. Oh my god, that was so awkward. Uh, yeah, what was that guy's problem? Who is he anyways? Uh, yeah, he's my ex-boyfriend. I mean, I thought he was going to be in jail, but I guess maybe he's released. I don't know. I mean, this is the reason why I didn't want to come to the movie theaters, but I don't want him stopping me from, like, having fun, you know? So, yeah, that's what happened. Well, whatever. It's his loss. Let's just watch and enjoy the movie. Yeah, you're right. We're here to have fun. Let's just enjoy the movie, like you said. I'm excited. They think I'm a creep, huh? I'll show them what a creep can do. Aw, Kitty smells so nice, and she looks so cute when she's eating popcorn and watching the movie. Ah, uh, yes, this is perfect. Hmm? What did you say? Two hours later. Wow, that was a fun movie. Thank you for inviting me, Coffee. Yeah, no problem. That was so much fun. Thank you for coming. Well, it's getting late. We should probably start heading home. Yeah, you're right. Let's start heading home now. Not so fast. Where do you think you're going, little lovebirds? Oh my god, what are you doing with the gun? This is a, literally a public place. Why are you being so crazy, Tony? Uh, yeah, dude, what's your problem? My problem is you're in my theater with my girlfriend. Dude, she's clearly not your girlfriend. You guys are definitely broken up. Yeah, Tony, and also we're just friends. Like, you know, girls and guys can be friends, right? Like, we don't always have to be on a date if I'm with a guy. Like, come on now. Put the gun down. Like, you're starting to scare me. I'm only going to put the gun down if you come home with me. And that's the only way you're going to leave. I'm only going to say this once. Put the gun away or you're going to regret this. Oh, you think you're so tough, don't you? Coffee, you're gonna make him mad. Just let's go. I'll just go with him, I guess. No, you're not, Kitty. Leave this to me. Yeah. Wow. Ow. Oh my god, Coffee, are you okay? Yeah, I am. Let's get out of here. Uh, why did he have to be so strong? I look so dumb now. Uh, Kitty, are you okay? Yeah, I'm just a little startled. And how did you learn how to kick like that? That was like some top tier, like, martial arts. Oh, I just took a couple of the self-defense classes. No worries. Well, I do want to go ahead and take you home. I, I do want to keep you safe. So let me walk you home. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. I just want to go to sleep now. Okay, then let's go. Finally at your house now, Kitty. And again, I'm really sorry that that happened. I'll make sure that everything's okay, though. Yeah, it's okay. I'm already used to him being a weirdo, but he's never pulled a gun out on me. Like, that was next level. That was not necessary. I was a little scared, but I'm glad that I'm home. And thank you so much for walking me home. That was really sweet of you. Yeah, no problem, Kitty. I, if you don't mind, I just have one question to ask you. You don't have to answer if you don't want to, though. Oh, um, yeah. What's your question, Coffee? Um, ask me anything. Well, since I broke with my girlfriend, you're single... I'm single, and I was just thinking maybe... Be sure to like and subscribe. Hey -ya! This 
is bittersweet. I can't believe I'm moving out. The house just doesn't look the same without all of my little things around. And you're probably wondering, did Gretchen really sell my house? No, that was just a nightmare. But I've been having a lot of creepy stuff happen here and I just feel like I need a new space, a new house, and this place is a little small for me. I just need a bigger space. Oh, let me just finish up packing. Hey, hey, hey. Looks like Kitty is getting ready to move out of her little precious pink house. She thinks I've been over her, but you know, I just cannot stop thinking about her. But she definitely doesn't know that I've been stalking her with my GPS system, so I know exactly what she's been doing. I know that she has that little crush of her coffees, and I'm gonna deal with them later because I'm the only one that can have Kitty's heart. Excuse me? I better start going now so I can set up in her new place. Get my cameras going so I can keep an extra close eye on her. Bye, precious house. I've had so many good memories in there. I just can't believe I'm leaving, but you know what? This is the brand new start and I'm so excited. This is gonna be amazing. Time to get the last few boxes on the moving track and I'm just gonna drive myself to my new place. Eee! Okay, and here we go. These are the last boxes and I'm done. Oh my God, who knew moving would be so tedious? I literally cannot believe how tired I am. Okay, time to drive to my new place and just enjoy the rest of the day. But why am I getting this weird feeling like someone is stalking me? I haven't really had like anything weird happen. I mean, it's only been like two days, but I don't know. I'm just getting this weird feeling like someone's watching me. Eh, it's probably nothing. Okay. I made it inside her new house. Time to set up the cameras. <laughs> Ooh, this looks like a perfect spot to put a camera in her bedroom. <laughs> Please don't play with me right now. Just, no, that's it. I cannot believe I'm doing this. This is so creepy, even for me. All right, here's another camera we're gonna set up. This one has a clear view of the shower. So when she gets in here, I'll be able to see everything. And that's my evil plan. All right, I think it's time to go. I've set up all my cameras that I needed. Hmm, the TV's not on. I think I'll put on the Kissing Bunny show for her. I know that's her favorite show and it might score me some points. They're all better. I really hope this plan works. I miss her so much and I really want to show how much I care about her. I really want her back in my life. Even if I was toxic. Uh oh, I think I hear the car coming up. I gotta go out the back door. Ooh, I am coming in on my house. Eee. Look, isn't it so pretty? It's literally so perfect and so pink. <sighs> I can't believe it. This is my new home and it's so beautiful. Hey, time to go inside and check it out. <gasps> oh my gosh, look how pretty this place is and it's so big. <gasps> Wait a minute, why is the Kissing Bunny show on? That's really weird that the TV would be on. I mean, I haven't even been inside the house at all today or ever. Oh, you know what it could be? I think maybe the realtor might have left it on. Yeah, I think that might be it. I mean, who could resist the Kissing Bunny show? It's literally so cute. Okay, I think it's start to unpack and just start getting used to this new place. Okay, I finished all the unpacking. Literally one of the worst things about moving is just being so tired after unpacking everything, packing everything, and then putting everything where it needs to go. But I'm just so glad I'm done now. Ooh, and I'm a little hungry. I think I'm gonna make some bread in my new house. I'm thinking waffles. Oh my God, this kitchen is literally so gorgeous and it's so big too. Okay, I gotta pull up my recipe and let's get started. I knew she'd like it if I left the kissing bunny show on. It makes me so happy to see 
her smile. She also looks really hot when she's cooking. I'm gonna text her to see if she really is happy to see me. And it says to add a little bit of sugar and some of this and some of that. Oh my god, I really love to cook. It makes me feel so relaxed. And the, am I getting a text message? Who is messaging me today? I told him I'd be busy today. Okay, let me see who this is. What in the, my ex-boyfriend? <laughs> She's gonna be so happy to see my text message. It's gonna probably make her day and make her want me so bad. Ew, uh, why is he texting me? I told him like a million times. Like I keep blocking him and I don't know how he's getting my number again. This is so gross. <sighs> What? There's no way she means that. That means she loves me, right? I mean, what else could it mean? And he's probably thinking, oh, that probably means it loves me. Um, no, that's not what it means. I do not love you. And I do not miss you. And I don't want anything to do with you. Yes, I did that. And you would do it too for a check. <sighs> Let me put my phone away and finish cooking. Oh my gosh, I kind of lost my appetite. Uh, I don't know what to do now. I have all this food here. Maybe I'll just save it for later. That is so gross. It must be a mistake. She doesn't mean that. She is the love of my life after all. Uh, I think I'm gonna go take a shower. I feel so gross now. <sighs> One thing I don't want is my ex finding out where I live. That would be so gross. I know he likes to stalk me and be weird, but I literally just want my own space. I just moved here and I just want to enjoy my house. Okay, time to take a shower. Ooh, kitty's about to hop in the shower. It's showtime. I just keep getting this weird feeling that somebody is watching me. Maybe it's just me moving into a new place, but I'm really sweaty from moving. I think I need to hop in the shower now. I think I'm overthinking it. I got another text message from my ex again. It says, I miss you. Can't wait to see you again. Call me. Um, literally, I am not going to call you. There is no way in heck I'm going to do that. You are so creepy. Get over yourself. Okay, it's shower time. Oh my gosh, this shower is so nice. Nice. Wait, what's that beeping sound? I've never heard a beeping sound coming from a shower. Wait a minute, what's that shining light over there? Is that a camera? Wait a minute, let me get this down. Oh my God, it's kind of hard. What in the heck? It's like if it was super glued in. Aha, I got it, it is a camera. Who would put a camera in the shower? Wait a minute, why does it say Tony on it? This is my ex's phone. And camera? And pictures? Oh no, she's catching on to me. I gotta make a run for it. Not so fast, Tony. Oh, hey kitty. Um, how are you doing? Fancy seeing you here. Yeah, it's fancy seeing you here in my backyard with a camera in my bathroom. What are you doing here? And why have you been texting me? I told you I don't want to be with you ever again. Uh, camera? Uh, that wasn't me. Uh, must have been somebody else. Uh, I have a taser in my hand and I'm not afraid to use it. Now open up and tell me what you're talking about. And why is there a camera in my shower? Okay, okay, sheesh. So I just saw that you were gonna be moving and I thought maybe that would be a chance for me to show you how much I care about you. You know, just like the good old days when you used to love me and not hate me or pull a taser on me. Tony, I literally do those things because you've cheated on me, you've lied to me, and try to get together with my grandma. Like, that is so gross. Like, get a life. Hey, it's not my fault your whole family is hot. <laughs> okay, that's it. You're going down. Ow. Ow. No, kitty, stop. That'll teach you for intruding and talking about my grandma again. That's a sensitive subject. I will never get over you, kitty. I just love you too much. Blech. Ew, get away from me, you creep. My gosh, kitties, I literally cannot believe that just happened. Creepy exes need to stay exes. But anyways, thank you for watching. And if you like this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And also, let me know what your favorite part was down in the comments. And now that nobody is creepy on me, I can enjoy my new house. Just like I got my new apartment. I thought it'd be so fun to make a new video about having a new place. And I really wanted to move into this roller pretty house. But anyways, have a great day, kitties and I'll see you later. Bye.